Offer jacket is out, which can only mean one thing. It is Christmas season. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. My name is Tomas and you guys, this is officially my first video as we are heading into the holiday season. I know it's kind of early, but it's already starting to get really cold here in LA and I'm starting to feel the Christmas spirit and I wanted to jump straight into my holiday content. So the other day I went to Target to get, actually I wanted to get a new Stanley Cup and look at this beautiful color, you guys. It matches the wall that, that I recently did in my bedroom so beautifully, I love it. But I, when I was there, I noticed that they were already starting to put out their new holiday collections. So we're gonna go ahead and check it out right now. I'm gonna take you guys with and let's see what is new for the winter and holiday collection 2024 at Target. Let's check it out right now. As soon as I got to Target, the first thing that I wanted to check out was the dollar section. And you guys, I was so impressed this year. I particularly loved these throw pillows that were only $5. Then as I was checking this side out, I saw this baking kit. I thought this was such a cute gift for kids maybe. This roller pin was beautiful. It was ceramic. Again, all of these were $5. And then here's one more look at those pillows. I specifically love the gingerbread one. You guys, this is a perfect time to go shopping for Christmas decor. All the threshold items were 50% off, all the ornaments as soon as you walked in. Then I made my way to the Studio McGee Holiday 2024 collection. It was so beautiful. I like sticking with classics. I love using a red, green, and gold color palette in my Christmas decor. So this year, these items were so perfect. I checked these candles out. They were $15 for the bigger ones and then $10 for this one. I will say they were not my favorite scents. Now these cone-shaped trees, they're not my favorite. I'm not a huge fan, but they are very trendy. If this is your style, there's a lot of options. I prefer this kind of more traditional looking tree. They had ones with the fake snow and ones that were just plain. I love the look of these so much more. I saw this countdown garland. I loved the look of this one. Then this other tree with the berries, I really liked the look of this one. It was only $15. I think that's a great price for the size. A lot of nutcrackers, some bigger, some smaller. I particularly liked this brass one. It felt really good quality. It was a little bit heavy. It was $25. A lot of faux garlands and wreaths with a lot of options with the snow, plain berries, and so much faux florals and plants, both in the Studio McGee and in the Magnolia section that I will show you guys in just a little bit. I loved these stocking holders with the marble and the brass hooks. I think they are a very timeless look. They were only $15. A lot of berry options with the leaves. Then some throw pillows. So these ones are not my favorite, you guys. I think that they look a little bit cheap, but there's definitely some better options that I'll show you in a second for throw pillows. I loved these advent calendars they're so pretty they were 35 dollars they were solid wood this is an example of a throw pillow that i kind of like more this style especially the one with the trees right here in the middle i thought it was really cute this throw blanket was beautiful it was 25 dollars i loved the feel and look of it then magnolia had these dry florals for 14.99 All in all, the Studio McGee section had so many options, so many options with the faux plants to add, to give more volume to your wreaths or garlands or even to insert in your tree. I loved all the berry touches. I loved this wreath with the bow and all the little burnt orange and red details. I think they go beautifully with the green and this one was $35. This base right here with the plants was not my favorite. I still wanted to show it to you guys. Some more trees. 
Now these vases with the faux plants and the berries, I think that this one was a much cuter look than the one that I just showed you. I like the base of it and I do like the look of the faux plants. This arrangement was $25 and then this one next to it was also very pretty. Some wreaths with some other color palettes just in case red is not your vibe. Then we had more of these rat tan trees. The smaller one was $10, the bigger one was $20. I really liked it. Now this wall art, I think it's going to sell out super quickly. It's only $12 and I think it's a very cute print and the perfect size. This stocking holder was so beautiful with the red marble on top and the brass hook. I loved this one. This garland I thought was super pretty to add some texture. Got a lot of ornaments with some more neutral palettes. Now these throw pillows I like a lot more than the ones that I showed you earlier. Same with the throw blankets. I think the color palettes on this one just works a little better and feels a little more timeless. I loved all of these throw pillows. They feel so much more elegant and more expensive compared to the previous ones. Now, I had to take a look at these taper candles. I loved the colors on these ones, and the prices were really good. There were only $12 for a pack of four. I wanted to quickly show you this floor lamp. It came out during the full collection, but I think that the shade on that one would look so beautiful during the holiday season because it has those green tones. Then I made my way into the Hearth in Hand by Magnolia section. So much faux greenery in this one. That's garlands, floral arrangements, so many wreaths. They were super, super beautiful. This wreath right here was $44. I loved the look of it. Again, with the bows and the more muted tones. This floral arrangement wasn't particularly my favorite, but I still wanted to show it to you guys. I believe it was $25. They had these smaller wreaths that you can add to cabinet doors. I liked their wrapping paper and tags. They had so much variety and I loved the color patterns and the look of them. I really wanted to share those with you guys. Now these taper candle holders were not my favorite in terms of the color of the gold. They were $15, but not my favorite. These candles were so good. They came in so many different sizes and different containers and vessels with the same scents. This one, the mule spice smelled so, so good. And again, they have so many different container options with the same scents. I think this little candle set is such a good gift and i loved the look of it if you want to buy a taper candle holder i would definitely go with this one as a centerpiece i think it would be so beautiful it was such a big size and it was only 40 dollars Some more throw pillows. I really liked the patterns and prints in these, especially the plaid. Some kitchen essentials and items, stuff that you can easily swap out during the Christmas season and during the holidays. Then I found these throw blankets that I was obsessed with. I loved the colors, the patterns, the texture. They were $29.99, which I think is a little bit pricey for a throw blanket, but I think they would make really good gifts. Then I saw some more countdown calendars, some more advent calendars, more garlands and faux florals, stocking holders, just a lot of options in a lot of different materials, which I think is great. I was obsessed with these mugs with the little stamps on them. They were $6.99. I think that is such a great price. And again, this would make such a beautiful gift. Just some ornaments with those same prints. I liked this letter to Santa's mailbox. It was super heavy and really good quality. 
Then on the opposite side, I found some prints that I really liked, some stockings that I think were super pretty. This is the one of the prints that I loved. This one was $19.99. I think it's such a great price. Then I saw these LED window candles. Now, they were $14.99. If you're going to put these in every single window in your home, then they're, that's going to be a little bit expensive. And I felt like the quality wasn't the best. This throw pillow was lovely, $19.99. More stockings. I loved this other print that I show you right here. I love the olive green color and the print itself was so beautiful. Perfect for the winter time. This one was again $19.99. Now, if you're in need for some holiday bedding, all of the Threshold Casa Luna items were 40% off. I specifically loved this performance sheet set. The print was so beautiful. Then I made my way to the actual Threshold Christmas section. This is all of the Winter Wonderland, all the Christmas trees, the more colorful ornaments, and the more generic Christmas decorations. I believe everything in the Wonder Shop was 50% off right now, so there's really some great deals, a lot of decor options, some wreaths, more garlands, more traditional looks a lot of items to throw in your tree and to use as additional layers when you are doing your Christmas decorating. And I wanted to share this with you guys. It usually is every year the same things here. So it's not like a new collection, but I think, but I do think that you can find some great pieces with really good prices in the Wonderland section. So definitely check it out. It's always towards the back of your target. Alright everyone and those are all the things that we saw at Target for all of their winter collections. We checked out Studio McGee, we checked out Magnolia, we checked out Threshold. Uh, really a big variety depending what your interior design style is. I think that there's so so many options and some pretty good finds and then some others that maybe weren't my favorite but definitely some good hidden gems in there. I really really liked it and of course I loved it taking you guys with I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know down below what your favorite product from the new holiday collection and winter collection are and let me know if you've already picked out some of these pieces or if you're planning on doing so I would love to hear which items you guys end up choosing but that is gonna be it for today's video thank you guys so much for watching make sure to subscribe if you haven't done so yet you guys can hit the bell button to be notified every single time I make a new upload that way you don't miss any of my videos but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye guys.